Hey everyone, thanks so much for joining me today. Before we start, please make sure to like and subscribe. That way I know you're enjoying the video. Now let's get started. Hey everyone, so today I'm gonna to be showing you how to draw a hot air balloon. Okay, so to start, I'm gonna go ahead and grab six different colors. You can choose whatever colors you'd like. Um, just make them fun, make them bright. Um, so I'm gonna choose for my first color, I'm gonna choose a red marker, okay? And we're gonna start right here. So kind of towards the bottom middle-ish of the page, okay? And we're gonna just put a little dot there. And we're gonna take this, we're gonna come up with a big curved line, okay? We're gonna go like there. So just a little bit past where this mark is. And we're gonna come back down. And we're gonna connect it to the bottom, okay? Just like that. Okay, now I'm gonna go ahead and just fill this in a second. And I might speed this up. So if you need to pause it and catch up, that's more than okay. All right, great job. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that red marker away, but just for a little bit, okay? Next, I chose, let's do an orange marker. Let's do that, okay? Now this is gonna be a very similar shape. We're gonna make this just a little bit different though. So I'm gonna put just a little line at the bottom, okay? And then we're gonna go up at the top and we're just gonna extend it a little bit further, just like that, okay? And from here, I'm just gonna make Kind of the same shape. It's gonna be a little bit thicker in the middle. And then we're gonna connect it to this bottom piece, okay? So if you wanna even stop in the middle and then start from the bottom to make sure it connects, that's more than okay. All right, now I'm gonna go ahead and color this in. All right, and I'm gonna go ahead and put that orange marker away just for a minute. And I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna grab a yellow marker. All right, so again, we're gonna start at the top. We're gonna make it go just a little bit further, like that. Now at the bottom, I'm just gonna go a little bit like that, okay? So we're gonna bring it back up. Make it a little bit thicker in the middle and connect it up to the top. And then, as you know, we're gonna color it in. All right, then you can go ahead and put that yellow marker away. And I'm gonna go with a green marker. Okay, so again, we're gonna put little line like that. Come just a little bit further up top. And then this line is almost gonna be straight down. Connect it like that. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and color this in. All right, and then go ahead and put that green marker away. And I'm gonna go with a blue marker next. Okay, and this is where it's gonna kind of start to shift just a little bit, because we're gonna go to the second half of the balloon, okay? So this one, instead of curving like this, it's gonna curve like this, okay? So put a little line up top. See, it has a little bit of a curve to it. Okay. All right, awesome. Next, I'm gonna go ahead and grab a purple marker. 
All right, so I'm just gonna put a little line like that. Little line like that. And connect it to the bottom. All right, now I'm gonna color it in. Right, put that purple marker away. Now, whatever color you chose first for this side over here, why don't you go ahead and do the same color, okay? So for me, that's red. So I'm gonna add a little line of red. Add a little bit up top like that. I'm gonna take it out. Connect it down to the bottom. All right, put the red away. And now we're gonna choose whatever color you chose for the second one here. So for me, that was orange. So I'm gonna go ahead and just put a little line like that. And make a line like this. Come down, as you know by now, we're just gonna connect it to the bottom. Okay, and then you can go ahead and color that in. Right, awesome. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and take one more color. I'm just gonna take uh, maybe like the blue, okay? And I'm just gonna put a line across the bottom so that, that way we can attach our basket to something, okay? So a line like that. I'm just gonna go across. All right, now from here, I'm gonna go ahead and grab a black marker, okay? And at the far corners, so right here, I'm just gonna draw a line down. And at this far corner, I'm gonna draw a line down. And then just a little bit in, there's another line. And then same thing on the other side, just a little bit in. And a line down like that, okay? Now, you can put that away for a minute. I'm gonna grab a light brown marker, okay? And now we're gonna draw the basket. So, this is basically just gonna be a square, okay? So if you go like this, you can kind of make the basket however big you want. We're just gonna draw a line down, and then a line across, just like that. It doesn't have to be perfect. Some baskets are bigger, some baskets are smaller. Not all the lines are perfectly straight. Awesome. Now we're gonna go back through it with a little bit darker color brown, okay? And this is where it's gonna make it look more like a basket, okay? So I'm gonna take this top Part, and I'm just gonna go over it with brown. Might look a little dark, but that's all right. So just like that. And then from here, I'm gonna do another line. Maybe not quite as thick. And then we're gonna do another line, a little bit further down. Let me actually see, yeah. Good job. So now we're just gonna put a couple other, just lines, just straight lines. This is gonna make it look like it's woven. And then you're just gonna alternate. So if you did a line here, we're gonna put a line 
in the middle there. And we're gonna put one at the side like that. One like that, in the middle, and just continue to repeat this, okay? All right, and then I'm gonna outline the bottom as well. So I'm just gonna put a line across. And I'm just gonna do the sides too. All right, awesome. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and grab my black marker and we're just gonna outline the colors up top, okay? Actually, before we do that, I'm gonna go ahead and make this orange just a little bit more rounded. That way it looks a little bit more like it has air in it. See how that looks just a little bit better? Okay, now I can grab my black marker. And this is where I'm just gonna outline all the colors, okay? So, for example, we're gonna go like this, like this. See how I'm just going right in between these colors. And we'll just do it to the next one. All right, guys, and just like that, you are all done drawing a hot air balloon. Uh, I'd love to see what you guys came up with or what you did different, what colors you chose, if maybe you put little people in your basket or a dog or whatever you chose. Um, and please remember that drawing always takes practice. So remember to practice and practice and to always have fun. Thanks, everyone.